Well, I feel like my makeup don't match my neck today. I don't even care. Hey y'all, welcome back to Two Cents, a place where your opinion is actually needed. Please subscribe and turn on your post notifications. I do post notification shout outs in every video. So all you have to do is subscribe, hit the notification bell, and then let me know in the comments that you have turned on your post notifications and I will give you a shout out in one of my future videos. That leads me to today's post notification shout out. Today's post notification shout out goes to Shamara Pertle. I hope I'm saying that right. Thank you for being subscribed to my channel and thank you for having your post notifications turned on so you don't miss any of my future uploads. Please give this video a thumbs up. It really helps out my channel. And with that said, I'm just going to hop right into this email. Okay, so this says, okay, so I'm guessing you would classify this as a crazy one. I don't really need advice, but I just wanted to tell my story. So I've been super close to my best friend for about 12 years. It's no secret that he's been trying to have a kid with his wife for about seven years. He told me that they've been to a fertility specialist and have had every test in the book he told me that it wasn't her it was him and that his sperm count was crazy low he said that the reason why they haven't been able to have a kid all these years is because they only have a four percent chance of conceiving a baby he said he was going to let it go and that it was mainly his wife that wanted kids and that if god didn't want them to have kids he was okay with that but that's clearly not the way she feels I say that because a couple of weeks ago, maybe a month, she calls me and tells me she needs to talk to me. I thought she was trying to plan a surprise party for him because his birthday was in a few months, so I didn't think anything of it. We met at a Target that has a Starbucks in it. She sat in the back and didn't waste any time telling me why she had called me. She was nervous, but she blurted it out. I want you to get me pregnant. I was shocked. She went on to explain wh why, which I had already knew because he told me. She started talking about if we were going to do it, we need to do it soon so that she can tell him she's pregnant on his birthday. I told her that she had lost her mind and asked her if it was that deep that she was willing that she was willing to cheat on him with his best friend at that. I asked her why they couldn't just adopt and she said she wanted a baby with her own DNA. I said, what about your husband's DNA? And she got silent. After she figured out that I wasn't going for it, she begged me not to tell him and that it will ruin our lives. That's my best friend, my brother, and I feel like I'd do anything for him, except that it's not worth our friendship. She's crazy. Leave your two cents in the comments. Again, make sure you give this video a thumbs up. That was it for today's video. I will see you guys in my next video.